and I'm so sad about it. Ah, I can't do this jump. I knew there were gonna be certain jumps that there was just no way I was gonna be able to do without, no, come on. And welcome back to another episode of Minecraft. As you guys can see, the scene is a little bit different than my normal Minecraft video starts. Mainly just because I'm normally on Hypixel when I start a Minecraft video. But today I thought it would be super duper fun to come on and actually play a parkour map. This isn't the first time I've actually played this parkour map. I've actually played it maybe three or so years ago, and I was not very good at parkour back then. I've been playing Minecraft for a little bit ever since then, and I think I've improved my parkour skills. We're gonna find out today. Today is either gonna go really, really well, and I'm gonna be able to finish this parkour map, or I'm gonna rage, and it's gonna be just really, really bad. So anyways, this is the parkour map I'm playing. It's made by this guy right here. Hello, and welcome to parkour school. Rules, no placing or breaking, hacking, teleporting, flying, creative, punching, beating illegal stuff mods. I like how it just says illegal stuff. No illegal things today. And lastly, no not having fun. Yeah, guys, we're gonna have so much fun today. We're gonna totally not rage and get really, really angry when we're not able to do these things. If any of these rules make you not have fun, oh well, go ahead and do them. I'm not liable if you go to jail or get in trouble in any way. Yay! Guys, what if we go to Minecraft jail? What if we go to Minecraft jail? Settings should be peaceful, adventure mode, command blocks enabled, no PvP. Let me make sure all this stuff is good. Alrighty, guys, I think we are just about ready ready to get going on this. I'm kind of nervous because A, I have not done a parkour map in a really, really long time, and B, I've done this parkour map before, but I did so bad. It was when I was first kind of learning to do parkour. So did you read the rules we did? Good. Remember, spacebar is default jump. So like I said, this is actually parkour school, so it's going to give us a tutorial of how to do all things parkour, and then by the end, we get this crazy final challenge that is almost impossible. Good, but can you do it diagonally? I believe I can do it diagonally. This is going to be really embarrassing embarrassing if I fail on these first ones. Nice! Try it around a pole. I think I could still do this around a pole. I think this is still possible. Oh boy, please don't fall. Please don't fall. If you hold shift, you can't fall. Okay, well, we know that. I'm not gonna do it because we can just jump over all this. Wait, I didn't read some signs. By now, you can die if you fall. So here's a checkpoint. If you fall, you'll come back to the last thing. Checkpoint. Uh, okay, sleep. Wait, no, sleep. Oh, good morning, everybody. What a- Oh, I'm still stuck in this map, aren't I? Now let's practice sprinting. 1.7 users, hold control to sprint two, double click your move key for a boost sprint while doing this. Watch for gaps. Oh my goodness, if I fail on any of these ones, I'm gonna be so upset with myself. So we're just gonna dandily go across this and take our time. Be as patient as can. For small jumps like these, you don't need to sprint. If you walk before you jump, you'll go further. If you sprint before you- All right, I'm not gonna read a lot of these signs because I know a lot of the basics of parkour and I'm sure maybe a lot of you do too. Now try going higher with two. Oh no, my first fail. <laughs> I was getting too confident. No, that's just what I know is gonna happen in this is I'm just gonna get so confident with myself and I'm gonna feel like I'm on fire and I'm unstoppable because all these jumps should be super easy. And then by the end of it, I end up, you know, just failing a lot, which is not what we want. We do not want the failures today. Okay, let's just, let's take our time with this. Take our super duper time with this and just make it to the top of this. Sweet, next are long jumps. You can sprint, but it's actually possible to make these without sprint. Try it. Hold shift when you land because you may not fall off. That's the biggest thing I learned when I was learning parkour is to hold shift every time you land on a jump because it really helps. It really does help. All right, we have one death so far, one failure. Checkpoint two right here. Now with four block jumps is hardest sprint. So four block jumps are the pretty much hardest thing to do in Minecraft parkour. I do not like four block jumps. Especially if there's four block jumps one after another because you make the first one and you're like, yay, I did it. And then they just throw more at you and it's horrible. Hey, look, I can see the spawn from here. Where's the spawn? Oh, is that the spawn right? Wait, no, that's not the spawn. Where's the spawn? Oh, that's the spawn right there. Spawn. I'm going to hopefully not fall on top of you because that would be really bad and I would probably die. And Fishy doesn't want to die today. Fishy wants to live. He wants to live. I want to see if I can speed run through the rest of this potentially without any more deaths. I don't know if that's going to be possible, but we're going to try our best. I wish there was a death counter on the side too so you guys can see. Now, it's hard to jump up. Uh, wait, now if it's hard to jump up, what if we go down? I don't know, I guess we will have to see. Good, now let's jump special blocks. Try to jump on this. We can't jump on this because it's a fence post, but if we stop, oh no, what did I just say? I did not realize there was a gap right here. Oh no, we have two deaths so far. Okay, it is totally okay. We're just gonna take our time with this. See if possible, 
but it's a bit narrow. Oh, are these? Oh, I have a texture pack that has invisible glass. This is gonna be so hard. Okay, hard, right? A little bit harder for sure. And then, woo, ladders. Now I'll say one thing about ladders. This is probably where I struggle the most in Minecraft parkour because some ladder jumps just are so impossible. Try this if you dare. Oh boy, this is scary. Oh boy, this is really scary. All right, what we're gonna try and do is we're gonna jump from here to that corner and then we're gonna make it. So let's jump here and then, gee, I can't believe we did it. Oh my goodness, I can't believe we did it. This is woohoo! Checkpoint number four. I'm so glad we get a checkpoint after that one because I feel like that one was supposed to be really hard. Come hither, the sign says. We will, we shall come hither. We will come hither to this sign. How about some freestyle? Don't move a muscle. Okay, don't move, don't move, don't move, don't move. I feel like I'm not gonna. Wow, we made it. It really didn't seem like I was going to. Mountain climb. Is this like choose your own adventure? I played this parkour map a really long time ago, but I don't remember a lot of what it is. All I remember is at the very end, there's a super long, seemingly really hard challenge course that we have to complete. And I also remember it taking me like two or three hours the first time I ever did this. So we'll see if we can improve on our time. Oh, whoa, <laughs> I seem to have missed the water and I broke my flippers. Well, that's not good. Home sweet home. Did we make it? Is this the end? Did we make it all the way to the end? What is in the chest? It says breaking windows. Remember that although you're in adventure mode, you can still smash these windows, but don't smash all of them or you're stuck. <gasps> oh no, which ones do we smash? Are we supposed to jump from the bed? I think if I remember correctly, we're supposed to jump from the bed to the little shelf over here. And then, wait, wait, we can't, we can't, we can't smash the windows. You just lied to me. It says you can still break windows, but we can't break windows. Maybe it's because I'm in 1.8. I'm going to try this. Really? Trying to fly, are we? No, no, no. I want to go to game mode. Is it zero? No breaking blocks. All right, guys. Now we're in version 1.7. I'm really hoping that that was the problem. As you guys can see now, we are in version 1.7. So... Let's hope that this works. Is it gonna work? Oh my goodness. Okay, so it was the fact that we were in 1.8. You know, I read that it said it was a 1.7 map beforehand, but I just thought that maybe, oh no, we didn't make it. I just thought that maybe it wouldn't be a problem, but it turns out it was a super big problem. Wonder why they changed that in 1.8. Oh my goodness, this looks like it's gonna be a hard jump because we keep hitting our shoulder. My whole plan of doing this without any more deaths is pretty much over at this point. And I'm so sad about it. Ah! I can't do this jump. I knew there were gonna be certain jumps that there was just no way I was gonna be able to do without, no, come on. It is totally about to start. This jump we know we can make. It's this next jump. I'm gonna try to get as far over as I, no, we were on it. It stopped on it for a second. I knew we were on it. What if we just do it fast? We go this one and then this one. Okay, there we go. And then open that up and then home sweet home. Oh, I have an idea. If we break this one and then get to the top of it. Oh my goodness, please, no! Oh my goodness, I thought I just didn't make it on that one and I was about to be so sad. I am getting flashbacks of the last time I played this. Now, for Rage Parkour, you can TP to other players here. Well, I don't have any friends that I'm playing with this with, so I can't TP to anybody, no. It says, you mad, bro. I'm not mad. We're just going to hopefully be able to do this. We got more of these little corner jumps right here, but I feel pretty confident. Honestly, I'm feeling pretty confident. What if we're able to make this first try? That would be crazy because it's called the Rage Parkour, so we'll do our best. I wonder if Rage Parkour means there's not going to be very many checkpoints because that's going to be a little bit rage-inducing, but I suppose we will see. Now, these jumps right here are really hard because you have to go around the corner and then hug the wall again. So I know that those are super hard. Oh boy, it doesn't look like there's any checkpoints, so we got to be super careful. Oh, okay, make it to this one. It says go here. Wait, here? Oh, under the side of that. Okay. This one looks hard, but we made it. Just barely made it. And then go up to this one. They kind of trick you and make you, make you think that you could go onto that, but I don't even think that that is possible. Did we go to this one next? I think we do. And then I think we go to this one right here. Oh, please land it. Oh my goodness, just barely. Took a little bit of fall damage. Totally okay. And then we made it. And then checkpoint. Oh my goodness, guys. We actually made the rage inducing parkour on the first time. I'm very proud of myself. Now, which way do we go next? Do we go down? Is there a down way to go? Okay, more water. Please land in the water this time. Okay, we did it. I should be drawn to water. You would think as a fish, I would just be perfectly drawn to water every time, but not always the case. Now we shall see how you jump under pressure. We will also be working with timing. It's safe, don't worry. Oh, the little vines stopped us. Thank you, little vines. Okay, let's be very careful. Now we have lava. Oh, no, no. Fishy, fishy, hot, 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 hot. Please don't die. Oh, there you go. Now we know to be extra careful and do this with caution. Okay, no problems here. No problems here. 
What does that say? The key is jump early and avoid getting burnt. Yeah, because if you jump at the edge of the block, I think that definitely makes you get hurt. Oh, do we just run across this? Oh, I'm just gonna run across it. Please just be with the case. Okay. And then this one looks like we have to go that way. And then, oh boy, this seems really difficult. All right, let's try it though. Eee! And then, oh no, no. It stayed open the last time because we were in it. But oh boy, the checkpoint is all the way back here. We're not gonna talk about that. Or that. Alrighty, back here again. Okay, so we got this first one pretty well last time. We did okay. And then this one, I think the only reason we didn't quite make it, let's do, let's go up here again. Let's show the whole thing. So it looks like we need to go to the right and then circle around there. And then, oh boy, this looks like it's just gonna be a memory game. Wait for all the pistons to extend before you run this. All right, here we go. No, wait a minute, we didn't make the first jump. It's said to make all the pistons extend first. All right, make all the pistons extend first. And then as soon as I get off of it, oh boy. Oh boy, this seems really, really crazy. Let's go. We're gonna, oh no, maybe, are we not supposed to jump on the first one? But I feel like there's a gap on it, so we have to jump. I don't know what I'm doing wrong, help me. It seems like once I make this first jump is I just fall straight into the lava. Like I can't even land the first jump, which is really confusing. Wait for all the pistons to extend before you run this. This just makes me really confused because how am I supposed to do it if I can't even make this first jump? All right, we're gonna try it from as far forward as we could possibly be. So I think this is technically as far forward as we could be. And we're just gonna try to run it. Run, run, oh my goodness, we made it. Good, and now we do timing jumps that have these blocks. Top, so wait, now we do two, wait, top, so I'm so confused. It just said jump well, and that's what I'm gonna try and do. Oh, these are the head hitter ones. I know these. I know these jumps right here. I think I'm pretty good at these kinds of jumps. Not as bad, which is good because I want another checkpoint. Please give me another checkpoint at the top of this vine. Yes, oh my goodness, finally we have another checkpoint. Let's go ahead and sleep in our lovely bed right here so that I can think about the mistakes that I made last time. I think some of these signs are, are pretty broken. I give you more fun jumps. We're just gonna assume that we go this way and we're kind of like in the nether now. So I don't know what is technically going on with the signs, but let's just ignore the signs for now. I think we're pretty good at these. I think we know what we're doing. Look, redstone down there. It slash that. Okay. Yeah, look at all that redstone down there. It's pretty crazy. Good job, map creator, on all this crazy redstone. The funny thing is that this map is actually really old. I feel like this... Oh, no! I feel like this map is maybe five years old-ish. I know it was made just a really, really long time ago. Crazy how long I've been playing Minecraft for. It's been, it's been a lot of years. I think maybe six years I've been playing Minecraft, which is a long time to be playing one game, and I still love it. That's the crazy part. The crazy part is I still really enjoy it. All right, this is where around where I didn't make it last time. So I think I just was being silly. I don't know why I was being super silly because it seemed like that jump really wasn't that hard. No, that's a four block jump. It's not technically a four block jump, but it's three blocks forward and then one block high. So it's technically acts like a four block jump. So we're just gonna speed run through all of this because I feel like this is the only way we're gonna be able to make that jump. All right, here we go. Up here, I'm pretty sure is where it was. That one, no, it's so hard. Okay, I think this next jump is the jump that I keep. Yeah, this jump right here. So it's three blocks over and one block high, which is why it's been so hard. So I'm gonna try to start right here. There we go. All we needed was that momentum and then we need to not, okay, we just, let's just go in the, oh wait, no, the fire did, oh, it didn't light us on fire. Yay. We did so well. Do we have another checkpoint? We do have another checkpoint. Is this the switch for the checkpoint? Thank goodness, thank you map creator for this checkpoint right here. I'm so glad we didn't spend hours on this or on that section, I guess. Now for some special jumps. First up, the ice, they slide around. Yeah, ice makes you slide a ton. So, oh, whoa, makes you go fast. Whoa. Okay, we're good. And then we, and then we, okay, we made it. And then let's take time on these blocks up here. The good things about these blocks right here is you can just shift to the edge of the block and then go up, which is really good. Am I losing hunger? Am I still on peaceful mode? Nope, I need to be on peaceful mode. I forgot to change the, the, the difficulty back to peaceful. More of these just ice jumps, but they will sneak up on you. What did it say? Who's my friend? What did it say? Uh, shift is your friend. Oh, well for me, it's actually control. Now next parkour is peaceful mode only cactus jumps. Oh, cactus jumps. Wait, did we get a checkpoint? I really hope that this right here is a checkpoint. I'm pretty sure it's not though. So we'll have to see. We just have to go with the, the tick on this one. 
We got to make sure that every single time it ticks is when we're actually jumping. And that actually wasn't too bad. Yay. Then make this jump. If we don't make it here, I'm going to be so sad. Oh, wait, we got teleported. Well, now we've put the skills you've developed to the test. Have fun. This is the thing I was talking about where they challenge you at the very end and they give you this whole parkour course that you have to complete. And you have, I don't know if you have any checkpoints in this. I think every single room has its own checkpoint. So you just got to make sure that you make it to the end of every single room without having any problems with it. And we should be, oh, the last jump. Okay, we're still good though. We just made it to here. Okay, we made it back to here. And then we got to not hit our head on this last jump right here. I'm pretty sure that's what I did. Yay, checkpoint. Yay, we're in water. I love water. I fishy. Okay, here's some more ladder jumps right here. And I know that these ones are, oh, we have to kind of hang out down here. A little bit and then go up to this and come up to here jump on top of these ladders very slowly go over here no <laughs> ladders are so hard because you can get your little flippers caught well i guess in my case little flippers but i get my little flippers caught on them all the time and it just ends up being really bad news bears we don't like bad news bears here we really don't like it okay we made that jump make it to this jump and then make it to this jump and then really good Climb up the rest of these ladders and then go over to here, which is the thingy, and then go to the top of this. And then make it to this obsidian block. Oh, and then another one of these little jumps right here. But we're safe and secure. I'm sorry, I'm just kind of repeating myself, but this is a lot of focus and concentration. Oh boy, another one of these jumps. Okay, nope, nope, don't go back down. And yay, anti-cheat covering. Oh, because we go up above to get to the next stage. That is so cool. That's where we just were. All right, now these are some more timing jumps. So let's try our best to... No, they're so fast. This is what I struggled with a lot during the actual parkour course. So I feel like this is what we're going to really struggle with a lot here. But who knows? Maybe we'll do really well. Maybe we'll do really well. I feel like the... Oh, wait, we're here. Okay, we're safe. Then we can make it to this one. Oh, this one, I feel like we're just going to have to keep jumping up and then yeah we did it all right oh do we no way did we complete it oh we completed it oh my goodness for first place we get tons of fireworks and wait what is this a golden scepter i don't know what the golden scepter was but look we get so many fireworks yay how do we make it nighttime i feel like oh yeah here's nighttime is it nighttime yeah woohoo fireworks galore we made it Wow, like I said, guys, the first time I ever did this parkour course, it took me maybe two or three hours. So I'm really glad in my timing on how we did this one. What is the bonus level? We should do the bonus level. Uh, we, maybe we won't do the bonus level. We'll see how hard it is. Okay, water jumps. Oh, water jumps. Guys, I don't know if I'm going to be able to do these. I remember water jumps being really difficult. And I don't know how possible. Wait, wait, what? We're all the way back here. Thank you guys so much for watching. That is it for today's episode of Minecraft. I hope you guys did enjoy. If you did, please leave a like ring down below. Subscribe if you're not subscribed yet. If you made it all the way to the end of the video, comment. Well, those were some nice jumps you did back there. Down in the comment section below. I'll see you guys next time for another episode of Minecraft. Bye, guys.